Welcome to this Solid Mastermind top tip for Solid Edge. Before we start, remember you can access many more of these great videos by registering for a free Top Tips membership over at solidmastermind.com. In this session, we will look at a useful shortcut we can use when drawing a line that allows us to dynamically switch between line mode and art mode. This can be done by using an option within the command bar as well as a keyboard shortcut. Here we'll first place a horizontal line then select the arc option in the command bar. This will cause a circular glyph to appear at the start of the arc. We can use this to control the direction of the arc. If we drag the cursor out of the right quadrant, the arc will be tangent to the line and to the right. If we drag the arc out of the left quadrant, the arc will be tangent and to the left. If we drag the cursor out of the top quadrant, the arc will be perpendicular to the line in an upwards direction. And if we drag the arc through the bottom quadrant, it will be perpendicular in a downwards direction. In this example, we'll create the arc tangent and to the right. As soon as the arc has been created, the command reverts back to the line mode, but can be switched back to arc mode if required. Instead of using the command bar to do this, we can use the A key on the keyboard. Now the same rules apply as before when creating the arc. If we want to switch back to the line option, we can hit the L key on the keyboard. In this instance, we'll carry on and draw another horizontal line, making sure we line up with the other line. Then we'll switch back to arc again with the A key and close the shape. Since we've used this method to create the arcs, the correct connect and tangent relationships have been created in the geometry, as can be seen by the glyphs. If you liked this video, please comment on it using the space below. And remember, to access many more of these great Solid Edge videos, please register for a free Top Tips membership over at solidmastermind.com.